Yes, thank you, Jeff. John, are you now Bristol Rovers' official um, penalty taker? Yeah, I'd say, I'd say I was, yeah. Um, a lot of people, I think, against Oxford, Matt Harold and Lee Brown weren't on the pitch, and they were today. Was there any debate when the penalty was awarded, or is it something you discussed before the game that I want to now take penalties? Um, there's been sort of loose discussions, but the yeah, I said I'd have it, and I had it, and that's it. Yeah, I think I'm on from that. And, I mean, it was a very impressive penalty, wasn't it? Is it one that didn't give the keeper much chance? Yeah, I didn't really go for power, I just placed it and, yeah, went in. So, happy. Good start. Um, I think John Ward said the first half they belonged to Berry. What line was that, do you think? Sorry, what was that? Was the first half John Ward said that perhaps Berry were the better side in the first half? Yeah, I'd agree. Even though we got the early goal, um, I thought we were just slow to start, really. I think they would sort of beat us up in a little way and sort of got the better of us. Just first of things, really, and I think we did start slow, but... Uh, yeah, Gaffer got into us a bit uh, half time and we came out a lot stronger the second half. And I think it's probably point to probably a fair result in the end, to be honest. But um, yeah, we definitely picked up in the second half. Yeah, what did you do in the second half to play to play better than Barry? You think? Um, I think well, I think it was a big help the formation change. I think we brought um, Beards a little bit deeper, which was a big help to give uh, me and Ollie a bit, a bit of help because. You know, it was quite hard in there. But, um, yeah, I think that was a massive, massive change to get for um, change that and it helped us out massively. And we just a bit brighter and um, got on with it. And I, think, I think we needed a bit of a, a rock <coughs> up our bad sides, to be honest. Yeah. And I think that's what happened. And, uh, yeah, we were a lot stronger in the second half. And Ampi Santos really got into the game in the second half, showing his... Potential yet again for Rovers. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's a brilliant. Um, first start, he didn't really play to his strengths. We didn't um, really get the ball out to him enough. And I don't think you know, he had a lot of involvement in the first half, to be honest. But second half, um, obviously, we changed the formation. It, I think it suited everyone. And seeing him getting on the ball and causing, causing a left back um, a lot of trouble and stuff. And it helped because we've got to create a lot more chances and you know, we could have scored maybe. I would have, and yeah, it was a lot better the second half. Yeah, is it frustrating with the, with the pressure you had in the second half? You didn't finish very off, because I'm sure this is a game you targeted um, for, for three points. Yeah, yeah. Are they for last by They are, yeah. yeah. Only points, I think. Yeah, um, it would have been nice, wouldn't it? It would have been, but like I said, it was a tough game and probably a fair result, I'd say, in the end. But um, move on to the next one, stay positive. That's, I'm beating him four now, is it three or four? Four so, games now, yeah. and having missed the, um, the York game through suspension, you're looking forward to the replay now, um, you're looking forward to trying to get Rovers into the second round of the Cup. Yeah, I'm uh, confident. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. What's your FA Cup record like? Not bad, but I reckon it'll get better. So. Good stuff. And your top scorer still, five goals now. Um, don't put words in your mouth, but are you thinking at the very back of your mind I could get double figures this season? Uh, yeah. That's what I'm aiming for, but um, obviously I'd much rather just be winning and maybe not scoring, but yeah, it's great scoring and I want to score more. And obviously, I'd say I'm on penalties now, but you know, if I can get a few more from open play, it'd be brilliant as well. You know, so. yeah. And as a crowd favourite as well, you must be keen just to reward the fans for their support um, with a home victory. Yeah, it would have been nice, you know, I think they deserve a win. You know, we did, I think we did give our all out there, we did try our hardest and stuff, but they just left a little bit of quality, maybe, you know. And yeah, it would have been nice giving them a win because they deserve it, you know, as much as us. So yeah, if they just stick with us and, you know, keep keep backing the boys and it will come. Good man, thank you.